Sorry. Can Chin? He's here. Chin's here, hey. dude. Chin, come on up. Chin's right there. Come on up, Chin. Chin. Get up here, Chin. Chin, 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 Chin. Dude, I got to say this. This motherfucker. I'm not going to lie. Including this in part of your edit at the beginning of your video is incredibly, incredibly self-absorbed. He put this in his edit himself. This bit at the beginning. People calling his name. He must feel so fucking good. He must be on cloud nine, right? Chin must be on fucking Nimbus, right? Out there. Fucking RIP to the fucking creator. He must be on Nimbus, right? From Dragon Ball Z. Just floating on that shit. Like, yeah, here we go. That's, that's, grab, grab that warp mic, Chin. Let me tell you something about this guy. Of course he's taking his fucking laptop to work. He's in what? Austin, having fun. And of course he's got his laptop out working, of course. It's always sufficient for me to sip at the airport. Doesn't everybody sip at the airport? Why is he acting like he's the only person that drinks at an airport? That's why they have airport bars. That's why they have lounges. That's why they serve alcohol on the actual plane itself. Like, it's tradition. <laughs> Anyway, the audio is bad here. I'm just saying it's my first time flying first class. All thanks to my big bro. Who's his big bro? His actual big brother or he's talking about Brian Callen? Also, he needs to wash. He needs to shampoo his hair. That hair looks like he hasn't seen water in a long time. I wonder who's his big brother that bought him the fucking ticket. Let me load a bit of volume a little bit. Sorry, it's blowing out of my eardrums. Chin's levels on his vlog are fucking awful, bro. He maxes, he absolutely ramps it up right to the end. My fucking levels on my fucking OBS are all on red when he plays. Jesus Christ, Chin. Audio definitely isn't kin. He warned me about the American Airlines. Last Austin wouldn't be that great. The first whiskey or whiskey. That's first class. Is that first class on American Airlines? Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Cole, AZ, can we watch some of your old vlogs? Chin inspired content right there. <laughs> Cole, fuck you. Fuck you with a capital F. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay? Don't repeat that ever again. <laughs> Don't ever repeat that again. Don't ever repeat that again. Okay? We're never going to talk about it again. Don't ever repeat that again. Don't ever repeat that again. Oh my god. I need to put, I need to private some shit. Oh shit. Anyway. <laughs> Big up call. Big up call. Oh, bro, is this, is this first class? It looks pretty shit, isn't it? All that money and that's all you get. Like an extra, like it doesn't even look that great. You don't get to lie down. There's no crazy big TV. Is that it? Is that even a TV? There's no TV at all. Look, look at that. Nothing there. No TV, no nothing. Time to grab. I'm not gonna lie. Second, uh, counting the whiskeys that he fucking drinks. Am I the only person who? Yeah, exactly. Like young of us. It looks more like business class, isn't it? There's no, or, or maybe, oh, maybe I'm, maybe I'm being dumb. Maybe first class, the one that I'm thinking about, where you kind of sleep and shit, and you get given champagne. Maybe that is only dependent on certain flights, certain airlines. Maybe if you're flying from, what's the flight time from fucking LA to Austin, Texas? Let's go on the phone. Uh, LA to Austin. Is it four hours? Flight time. Let's see. Two, two hours, 50, okay. Three hour journey. 
is it am i being a little bit of a diva if i requ if i pay for first class i want first class three hours is enough to have first class treatment give me a little bed i might take a little nap give me a flute of champagne i think that's still a lot you know what i mean it's not six hours but three hours should be enough isn't it bring up wingers this is chin worthy what is that okay we have to check that out later my friend because we're going to watch this chin one now but I'll keep that. I'll keep that in rotation. I might actually save that for the two episode two hundred, brother. Yeah, I'll save that for episode two hundred. Big up Wingus McDingus. I'm not gonna click the link now, but I'll save it for the next one. Um, but yeah. Hmm. What was Brendan saying here? Brendan, Brent, what do you say, Brendan Mallory? Four hour flight or so. Okay, cool. I like Mexico one. Huh, let's see. Is he trying to get a rub and tug? <laughs> On a two hour flight. <laughs> yeah. I keep pressing the button, the little light. Dee, dee, it's a, it's so cool. I'm just furiously pressing it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, I was going to say, am I the only person that doesn't eat or drink on the plane? I'm such a cunt that I get a lot of pride out of not being on the plane eating and drinking. I like the control and the self-discipline that I have to have be like, I don't need food. I always skip the food. When they even come and offer you the food, even if it's free, I always skip it. I don't use the drinks. I don't need a drink. I don't need the fucking food. I always skip it. I might bring my own fucking bag of mixed nuts or something, but I'll never eat. Like, yummy yeah, a sign of weakness. Exactly. So rare design. Yeah. Honestly, I'm such a cunt like that. Like, I actually like being in control of myself and not being tempted by a shitty sandwich or a shitty lasagna or something it's like no nah, i'm good man you, you, you give this to the rest of these peasants when i land i'll go i'll go pig out properly i don't need to eat this shit maybe, maybe i'm unique in that regard big up unique The chicken and plant. Oh, okay. He's, he's eating a lot, isn't it? The chicken and plantain, pestles and rice. Of course, he's. Eating. Of course, he's eating on the plane. Of course, he's in. This is a shrimp salad. This was a. Uh, fucking hell! Oh, he's. Oh, he went with his brother. Okay, I thought he ordered another meal. I thought he had two meals. My bro got the same order. So thanks for showing us, by the way. Your bro got the same order, so you showed us. Cool. We saw two of the same things. Cool. Imagine being that age and still, like, how old do you have to be to stop? Like, I was a, I did that a lot in my in my youth. I'd be on my Instagram posting pictures of me having a cocktail, post a picture of my pint of beer. How old do you have to be to stop doing that? How, when are you not allowed to do that anymore? When are you not allowed to post a picture of you enjoying a drink? When do you have to grow up? 25? 26? 30? When's the age where you're not allowed to post... A picture of yourself having a whiskey anymore. <laughs> Super Jello <is> seven. <laughs> My original reason to go to Austin was for I'm visit family and support Brendan shows. It's very Rich. empty. Yeah. Unfortunately, his baby girl Airbnb. had to get emergency surgery and he had to cancel. She's good now, by the way. Oh, great. We don't care. TV. 1210 here at our Airbnb. I'll show you what it looks like right now. It's a nice Airbnb though. Let's not let's not lie. I think Austin, Texas has some nice fucking Airbnbs. That's a nice fucking crib. No bitches though, right? Just chilling his brother, right? Giggling away in the corner. No fucking slags. No whores. No ladies of the nights. No boy toys. Right? Nothing. Just him and his brother. This looks pretty cool. My brother was filtering the tap water. Oh, awesome. Of course he was. They got into the fucking Airbnb and the first thing his brother does, big bro does, is start filtering the fucking tap water. Of course it's the first thing he does. Not calling the bitches, not opening Tinder or Grinder. Nah. First thing he does in a strange foreign land, let's get the filter the filter tap water ready. Fucking party boys, these guys are, innit? Proper party boys. Texas. Here's a living space. It's a nice couch. Really nice here. Airbnb. Nice view too. 
Leather. Oh, nice couch. Big TV. Leather. <laughs> we have a view. One more time. That was so redacted. He's definitely special needs. 100% he's special needs. It's a nice couch here. Leather. leather. Oh, really? Big leather? TV. No idea. We have a view of a parking lot. But it's still cool. Right here. There's two. an outside patio here. Two balconies. Wow, two balconies. Two wow. chairs. Chin two balconies. That's nice. Continue. And then let's check out, oh, washer dryer. Here's the first bedroom. Very nice and big. And then, uh, let's open this up. That's a really nice looking bathroom here too. And a huge closet. And there's me. <laughs> Let's go to the second bedroom here, which I'm guessing is going to be mine because I have to give the bigger one to my bigger brother. The other bathroom. I have to give the bigger one to my bigger Shut up, you fucking dork, man. Some of the, you don't need to admit these things on camera. You just say the, like, I'm the perfect brother. Oh, yuck. Care of yourself. I think I'll take this one. Okay, never mind that. And here's the second bedroom. A little smaller, nice and quaint. I'll probably be taking this one. But there's also a patio here too. Chin, three balconies. Three balconies, chin. Not two, three balconies. All right. Right into the Lovely view. Oh, this is a big closet too. All right, now that this. Also, why is he playing this horrible music in the background? Just like have it be a voice. Why does he need to have a backing track? Like, what's going on here? It's terrible as well. The song, like, just shitty copyright free music. Like, just speak, man. You don't need to play this horrible shit. It's all said and done. We're gonna get some sippies and some dinner, and then knock out some sippies. What's a sippies? Oh, I thought, I thought you said dicking. I said, you'll see what's making the clicking and clacking sound soon. Okay. We're going to get some sip. Is it sippy? Is it slang for beer? And then get a whole new start for the day tomorrow. Wake up early, probably get some coffee and then walk around Austin, downtown Austin. Eat. Or oh, is sippy's a brand of drink? Is that a brand of a drink or is that just a slang? Enjoy brotherly time together. Cringe, bro. And pause. All right. Peace out. And of course... Protect yourself. Who, Chin, Chin honestly thinks somebody's gonna come down and like run down on him. With a, like, this guy can barely cook fish, but he's able to carry a gun. <laughs> this guy can barely cook a good bacon and egg sandwich, but he's got a strap on him. Honestly, he probably end up doing more damage to himself. He doesn't need to have a strap. Fucking hell, man. Honestly, Chin is fucking incredible. He's pulling up to Austin strapped up. <laughs> anyway, it's only thing he's probably going to be strapping all weekend, isn't it, mate? Oi. <laughs> Random bar near the Airbnb. Of course, they go to the one bar next to the Airbnb with no bitches inside. Of course, nothing happened. Next day, <laughs> no action. Next day, we don't close, boys. Sure About to pass the river here. That looks awesome. I want to believe it's on day, but no time. Some boys doing some bass fishing over there. He's gonna wave at them. He's gonna say hi. Hi guys, I fish too. This is the coolest grocery store near us. What's cool about the grocery store? Oh, Jesus Christ. Who's that? Look at this. That baddie down there is giving chin the eyes, isn't it? That baddie down there is giving chin the eyes, eh? That little baddie behind the counter, eh? She's giving chin the eyes. Hmm. Look at that, eh? Oh, who's that, eh? Hello, Cindy. Hello, Daisy. Hello, Laura. Huh? Hello, Suzanne. Hello, Billy Jean. Billy Jane. Huh? Hello. 
Hello, Jade. Huh? Hello, Jennifer. Look at her. Little baddie down there. Mwah, mwah. So this is the uh, roast beef one, and this is the uh, chicken something or other. Maybe I can put it down on the... Are they half-eaten sandwiches? What is showing us there? Are they half-eaten sandwiches? And what was that skip? He went from being in a grocery store to suddenly having a, a sandwich carcass on the table. That looks awesome. Some boys doing some bass fishing over there. Mm -hmm. Little walkway. He's in the grocery store. Royal Blue Grocery Store. Gourmet Staples. They serve, you know, what grocery stores serve. Right then now. it cuts him in the Airbnb. So this is now he's in the Airbnb and he's got like a a half-eaten sandwich that he's doing a review of. The uh, roast beef one, and this is the uh, chicken something or other. Maybe I can put it down on the God Almighty bro. lower thirds. But that's all I'm gonna eat right now, cause, dude, my face and my body is getting so fat. So, so he bought him. So he bought himself half of a sandwich. He doesn't like to eat carbs, but he's he's buying one carb sandwich. Like, honestly, I gotta chill. I forgot to record. I'm already eating. But anyways, first one roast beef. We know I already took a bite. The main issue I have with food when you have to go. What restaurants or whatever? Is it they're always like overly salty? All right. <laughs> the guy that can't cook to save his life is complaining about salt on food that he goes out when he goes out to eat. Maybe learn how to cook better at home so he won't have to eat highly salted foods outdoors in restaurants. Maybe that should be the way to go about doing things. Maybe. But I could be wrong. Let's go into this chicken thingy. All right, let's take a bite first without dipping it in any sauces. I like this one better because it's not as salty. <sighs> Done. So, like, my sister's <laughs> This is miserable. What a miserable existence. You go away on a weekend to Austin, Texas to go and hang out with your brother and see some comedy, maybe, you know, dick down some whores. But then you're in your Airbnb working the entire weekend also. Finishing up work meetings. I know he enjoys it because he's a bit of a workaholic and he has no life. So clearly he enjoys, you know, being busy and doing things. But this this for me would be a miserable existence. I'd hate this, man. To never be not on call. Nah, no, fuck that. Later that night. Checking out the town with my brother. This is Chin's brother doesn't like being on camera, does he? Chin's brother probably made it very clear. If we go on holiday together, do not show me on camera. Chin's brother doesn't like being on camera. Chin's avoiding recording him at all costs. That brother said, if you've recorded me, I'm going to kill you in your sleep. And we're a family of murderers, so you know I'm going to do it. It's crazy loud and popping right now. And it's all young people, so... It's all young people, right? Good, good fucking suspects of murder, huh? Prime targets. You know, they've got everything to live for. They're naive. They've got no special awareness. They're too trusting. Perfect victims for Chin. Perfect victims, allegedly, for Chin. A little out of place, but whatever. Oh, look, he's drinking alcohol. Big boy. By the way, what's the poor like in Austin, Texas, guys, in the stream chat? Are they are they good with the poor? Are they really stingy with the poor? Do they dilute their drinks? What's the bar culture like? Will I get fucked up quickly? Or will I have to buy a lot of shit to get fucked up? That's what I like about Europe. In Europe, in some places you can go, they free poor, man. They like, you know what I mean? Just a good little free poor. If you tip well, you might even get crazy amounts. I wonder. Austin's pretty good, says Pity. Texas the shit, baby, says Severa Design. Austin's supposed to be expensive. Oh, for drinks, I'm guessing, isn't it? Dallas, Texas is, is the house. B 
bitches. Okay, yeah, big up Severo Designers in Dallas. Dallas. Big up you in Dallas. Big D. That's like a cool bar. We are now looking for a pizza place. The, this place had pizza spot in the back. Wow, so loud and there's so many lights and loud music around, isn't it? Like, do people? Am I being a bit of a snob if I say that I want to mix? I want to I wanna be able to go to a bar that has no music and just has people chatting because that's something that is very popular in the UK. I'm not sure if you have it popular in the, in the states, but in the UK, it's very popular to have pubs and bars that don't ever play music. They have a no music policy. And some people just like that, just having the ambiance, people just chattering and talking and shit. But I don't know, Austin seems like the place where every bar is playing some form of music. That would drive me crazy. Even as someone, you know, who likes to play really loud music, I like also had the ability to kind of like temper it or to, you know, vary it somewhat. <laughs> Oh yeah, System of the Down is, yeah, System of the Down. Big up Koyla, yeah. Big up System of the Down, man. Legendary fucking band. One of the best live bands out there. Up there with Slipknot. Um, who else have I seen live who was that level? Um, they're probably the best two, I think. Live bands. Slipknot and System of the Down. When it comes to like pure value for money and putting on a good show, banging. Okay, the pizza prices. Authentic Detroit style pizza, $13 for a cheese pizza. Is that a good price for you in the States? That's a pretty good price here in the UK. That's about the same you'd pay. Big up Assad, appreciate you, brother. Big bro said the hoes might be watching. <laughs> Big bro, exactly. Big bro says those I imagine. Um, but yeah, these are good prices, right? Big up, uh, Assad. Appreciate it, brother. Uh, what do you got here? They got the four, the four cheeses, fifteen dollars. You got the carnivore. I guess that's all meat. That's seventeen. The most expensive here I can see is the rocket. Right, the rocket. <laughs> We got okay. Is that like a tang? We got some sips. Of course, we got some sips while waiting. Oh, that looks good though. That looks fucking good. That looks pretty good. The little square pieces. That looks fucking good. It's a bit light on the portion size, right? You only get four pieces. It's a bit, bit tight, but it looks fucking tasty. Yeah, exactly. You're right. Who said it? Brad, Brendan Mulry. Before you even saw the picture, you're right. Probably $30 for some little bullshit. Exactly. It was quite small, to be fair, for $30. You didn't get much. Look at how annoyed he is at all the music. He makes all that shitty la music that he makes, crying into the microphone. And look him getting annoyed by actual good tunes. By actual talented fucking artists. Look at him getting it. Look at his face. Look at his little face. <laughs> Look at him. Look how annoyed he is. Uh, big bro is like... Big bro. Why is he just calling him his name? Why do you keep saying him? Big bro, big bro. Call him by his name or something. Or give him a fucking nickname or initial. Big bro, big bro, big bro. Like, cringe, bro. I remember wanting some grilled cheese sandy band. Why is he talking like he's an Australian? My big bro wanting the grilled cheese sandy. A sippy. Like, bro, aren't you... F I don't know, bro. This guy thinks he's from fucking... What's it think? He thinks he's from Brisbane or some shit. A sandy. A sippy. Me and the boys. We're going off to get our dickies wetty. It's like, what? Good food. Good food. There's like a food truck, homes park, which is awesome. 
the one thing I would not like though about Austin, because I can see it, all the doors of all the bars are open and they blare the music to get people's attention who are walking by. So you've got all this noise coming from different bars trying to like, cap, you know, get your attention. But they also, you know, it makes it horrible to listen to. Here we go. Oh my God, that's so good. Genuine Detroit style pizza. It looks good though, it? it? does look good. Via 313 Pizzeria. Yeah. Amazing. It's so good. You're drunk. Bro, because you're drunk, exactly. Next day. So we are now on our way to our cousin's house, Ashley's house. So we're going to meet up with a bunch of our family. And I'll show you that later. No, he's authentic Austin. Look at his face. <laughs> this guy's 40 years old, you know. Or plus. Isn't he like 50? <laughs> yeah, look at this guy. And there's my brother. No. <laughs> We are ashes. Okay, he doesn't want to be on camera. I think Big Bro is really ugly. That's my 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 opinion is that I think Big Bro's if Chin looks the way he does, Big Bro probably looks worse than Chin. So he probably doesn't want to be on camera because he knows, you know, he's got a face on your mother could love. I think that's why he doesn't want to be on camera. Oh, doors unlocked. I'm not gonna walk by him. Welcome Hello. to Pantasy Island. It's a joke between me and my friend, uh, me and my, me and Ash. Oh, really? You and Ash, you got inside jokes. Shoes off, right? I ain't her. Oh, snap. Can you guys be a little bit more excited? <laughs> yeah. yeah. My cousin Anna was hugging my bro. Now was the first flaunt my aunt on King of the Sting. Aww. That's his cousin. Like that that's like his auntie, that's his cousin. Shit. You don't mind being on a vlog, right? No, if I knew you were gonna pull your camera, I would have pulled my camera. You should have, dude. I just put the camera on the charger. How's it going, dude? Dude. Good to yeah, see he records you. everything. It's, it's a little annoying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't have a moment. Ashley. Yeah. <laughs> also, put your camera down, have some family time, brother. Like honestly. He's so annoying, isn't it? This shitty vlog that's gonna get like what, ten thousand views if less. What's the point? Just put your camera down and enjoy some family time. Pull it out later. Hello, welcome to Fantasy Island. Fantasy okay. Island. Fantasy Island. Dude, I forgot my glasses, my actual glasses, so see, I can't see shite. Dude, this house is gorgeous. Thank you. What the heck? She picked it out. Really? Of course. Of course. Holy moly. <laughs> and here, let's take a look at Anna's brisket. Is that the, is that the, is that, is that the auntie? Yo, she's got a kadonka donk in it. Who's that? Who's that with a fucking crazy back off? Who's that with a fucking? Who's pulling that wagon? Who's pulling that fucking UPS truck? Who's pulling that Brinks truck there? Dee 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 dee. Who's pulling that fucking white van transit van thing? Who's got that fucking trunk in the fucking? Who's got that frunk in a fucking trunk? Huh? Who's got that fucking quesadilla in their fucking nyash? God damn. That she makes, she makes this, and it's amazing all the time. It's always like super, super tender and delicious. My cousin Anna makes the most amazing brisket every time we. Okay. My cousin, my cousin, my cousin, shut up. Just kidding. <laughs> delicious. And by the way, Anna. He's just picking up with his hands. That's the cousin. If you don't remember her, she's from the first flaunt my aunt. <laughs> and Shin's aunt. Oh! Ooh! Wait! Whoa! What the fuck is your aunt's name, Chin? Anna. What is it? Aunt Hannah. Aunt Anna? Aunt Hannah. Duh. Aunt Hannah? That ain't God damn. Aunt, aunt Hannah, hey, with all respect. I, how can you not pronounce Anna? Aunt ha Hannah? Yo, Brendan is so fucking redacted. It's incredible. He keeps saying. Aunt, Han Aunt Anna, and Brennan keeps saying, ah, ha, Hannah. One moment. From the first flaunt, my aunt. Um, and she 
Ben's aunt. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, whoa! What the fuck is your aunt's name, Chin? Anna. What is it? Aunt Hannah. Anna. Aunt Anna? Aunt Hannah. Duh. Aunt Hannah? That ain't God damn. Aunt, Aunt Hannah, hey, with all respect, <laughs> can't get it. Oh, God. Bro, give it up. Get away Give it up, bro. <laughs> give it up with your sweats, bro. Don't touch Dude, me. Dude, I cotton. fucking knew Chin was holding out. <laughs> damn, she's so Korean? Get, there's part, a little bit of Korean in there. Wow. God damn, I bet. I'd chop it down, bro. You know what I'm fucking saying? Fucking right, dude. you would. Oh, I'd, I'd share a fucking double scoop of orange chicken with her and talk about things. Oh, oh I yeah. karate kick her right into my bed, bro. What I'm talking about is, she seems like a, <laughs> she seemed like a nice lady, dude. I'd watch a marathon of fucking The Last Samurai with her with my dick out. Why, man? <laughs> Jesus, dude, just flaunt my aunt. Yeah, this, this is all good, bro. These are compliments. To, where did she go? To this is this is the uh, one. Remember back when the, when King of the Sing was funny. Remember when Brendan was actually trying to be a comedian. Remember when they used to get on really well. Good old days. School at Jen. Harvard in Texas. Yeah. Har you ever yeah. heard of it? Not Harvard. Sure. <laughs> well, there's a lot of schools in Texas, yeah, and there's a sure. lot of not schools in Texas. Um, <laughs> she looks like a nice lady. Did she bartend or not? <laughs> That's a good guess, though. I yeah. think when she was younger, she definitely did. <laughs> yep. yeah. Yeah. Fucking right. That. You gotta love Fia, isn't it? Does she bartend or no? Oh, uh, she definitely. Uh, look at the picture. That's like the picture looks like she's got a picture of like every bartender you've ever seen, right? Like, that that's a bartender, right? She definitely she runs that fucking bar like it's the fucking navy. You know what I mean? She's got that place running. You know what I mean? Nothing fucking sits by her. Good boss, but when you when you flip, f flip fuck up, she's on your ass. She yeah. never she made bang, bro. <laughs> and was she, she got a ever... body on her huh, chin? <laughs> it seemed like she was in the gold rush. Brendan asking Chin if his aunt's got a body on her is hilarious. She has a very, you know, kind of authentic sort of look, kind of, you know. Her like hair it... used to be like up here, the Texas big Texas hair. Oh, so beautiful. she's trimmed it down a little bit, but it's still high. Yeah. And she has a she has a little bit of southern twang too. That Texas twang. twang. Sure. Oh, Come here, bro. honey. Calls her own honey. Yep. Ooh, we. Oh, she looks like she make, makes a mean fucking bitsy and gravy. She's, she makes such good food. In Texas home. food. Brisket. I can see that. Brisket. She makes brisket. The best. This brisket. is wifey, son. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's oh, that's the that's a brother. We got we got a full face with a brother. Yeah, that's pro that's why he doesn't want to be on camera. Unfortunately, you know he's not blessed in the grill front. Unfortunately, he's not too blessed in the grill front. That's the reason why he doesn't want to be there. Okay, fair play, fair play, fair play. Who's that? Is that Chin's mum? I don't know who that lady is. Perfect. Chin and his brother are the only single ones in the whole family, isn't it? They're the only one with no bitches. They must get a lot of pressure. Everyone else has got kids, wives and shit. Chin's and his brother are the only ones who come with no fucking bitches. No nothing. No man them nothing. Just do like any kind of poses. Just do any kind of poses. <laughs> Alright, that's good. <laughs> Thanks my brother Tre my buddy Trevor Yoshida um Yasuda, sorry, we linked up with his good bud Matt Edgar. Comedy barbership things. We're out here sixth street with my fam. You can pro. use your phone and barbership so this camera. is after the show. With my cousins. And we're gonna try to find a good spot to eat. Hey, look at that tater top. Any breakfast beer that has like a potato on it? Yeah, that's what he yeah, That's the sweet spot. And even of all places in Texas, we came to Eureka Burger, which is everywhere in Orange. Can you imagine how annoying it must be to hang out with Chin? Your family members, you hadn't seen him in a while, he's coming to visit you, and he's just got this shitty camera out, just like recording this nut. Like, you're in a bar, man, it's not that big of a deal. You're having some casual bar food, like. It doesn't need to be recorded. No one gives a fuck. We've all seen places like this that serve beer and have burgers. Like, it's not that interesting content, you know? He must be so exhausting to hang out with as a family member. Like, again with a fucking camera. County too in LA. But hey, oh, really? it, looks, it looks, no, but they have alcohol, they have like beer, 
Alcohol, no beer. What the? They got no idea. They got hard like liquor. They got beer. <laughs> Derek, I just DM Chin's aunt. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Good luck, brother. Good luck. If you if you bust it down, you know, let us know, brother. If you bust it down, let us know. We'll cheer you on. Pizza, burgers, all that good stuff. So we're good to go. This is what we got going on so far. Do you, do you need to record this? It's a bar that serves burgers and chips and booze. We've all know we've we've all been to one. You don't need to record it, really, truly. You don't need to record this at all. Burger, another burger, another burger, another burger. Goddamn burger. <laughs> We're waiting on my fish and chips. It's gonna take a little bit. We're Ramsey's making them. Finally arrived. Fish and chips. I'll try it. Tell me what you think first. Tell me what you think first. Good. There's my boy Dan. Long time no see, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> so this is fairground. Damn, this place is dope. We are at a fairground in Austin, Texas right now. A night nice day. What is that, Dan? Blood orange cider. Remember this guy? Showtime now, That's him. Half Asian, half white. You know what I'm talking That's about. That's what diaries represent. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what is that, Dan? This is the French dip. Louis French dip. And you said that's Louis one of the best? Dip. That's the best. Aja? Aja's Aja. All right. I, I, it, I didn't think there was a difference in quality and meat juice. Mm -hmm. uh, mm. But you boy sliders, dude. Best Aja. Really? Yep. The best? Best. In your entire life? Yeah, dude. Oh, my gosh. That's what I bumped into. Hi. Who's that? What's the up with Hot Carl from my Chinder date on King and the Sting? I don't know who the, who the fuck is that? Hot Carl here. Well, my plan for tonight was to do what a typical Korean night is, right? So oh, usually we'd go, we'd grab drinks, uh, get Korean barbecue, grab dessert, which is usually boba. If you're Asian, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And there's, there's a specific boba that I love that I want her to try. And then afterwards, Small them go balls. to a karaoke studio and get even more drinks. Yeah. And then let me do what I think I do best. Yeah. Yeah, Jim. So, Carly, how are you feeling? Oh, shit. She's got them fucking hello helpers, isn't it, huh? She's got those big old hello, how you doing, huh? She got them swangers, huh? She got them melons, huh? She got them narangas, huh? Huh? Oof. Good. Good. Are you excited? Yeah. Watch the show, There's Brendan. Different Check out the bobas on Carly. It's a, someone of another race. Is that the same for you? No, I'm not. I don't really. No, it's more just like another date. Another. <laughs> I see it when I smell it slow. Oh, but cute. a little differently. <laughs> Very good, Chin. Is there any you other fucked this up, bro. Chin is allergic to girls, isn't it? Why didn't he, like, you know. You're a creep, bro. Put your my pants have my off. Location, dude, I, so I don't know. People just put your spare ribs with her, bro. Dude, do not pull your pants out if you're going to break up that little dick again. <laughs> I don't know. This is going to be fun. It's going down. I'm here in Ooh, what are we sipping on there? Beer? Bad idea. You can be farting, Chin. I love <laughs> the dumplings. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I didn't know. Hot coral. Oh, well, I'm oh, so. Well, there you go. Hot day. Hey. Oh, she's cute, huh? Look at she's, Chin. Look is that a nose piercing? Whoa, Chin. She has a nose piercing? Drinking. <laughs> Come on, man. High five her. Some contact. Let's see. Anyway, what, what happened when they met each other? What the? What the? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Jesus Christ, they're fun, innit? They are. F they should have been a thumbnail. That should have been the fucking thumbnail. They are fucking fun. Let me lick the, lick the screen. Let me lick the screen. They should. They, 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 that should have been the fucking thumbnail. <laughs> that should have been the fucking thumbnail. Fucking hell. All right, Chin. This is a this is a decent vlog now.
He made me. He, he made me do it. Oh, ho, ho, look at them. <laughs> Fun bags. Yeah, he definitely wants a bit of that, innit, eh? Oh, yeah, I get it. Oh, look at him. L letting us see the pants. Pulling up his shirt. Letting us see the dick print. Chin's, Chin's boy wants, wants to fuck his ting. Oh, man. Chin's boy wants to fuck his ting. Look at him. He's making sure she gets the whole she gets the whole frame. She can see his shape. You know? He's letting his fucking dick hang out. Oh, come on, Chin. You a nice broad shot? Look at him. Exactly. He's, and then Chin's helping him by zooming on his piece. <laughs> Big of a sod. She's got too much carbs for Chin. <laughs> yeah. That's a good point. Yeah, true. Yeah, she's too much of a woman for Chin. Chin couldn't handle that. She's too much woman. Chin needs a little bit more of a, of a petite lady. She's way too much woman for Chin. He will know. He know. He would know what to do with those fun bags. He'd be like, Ugh. your Chin would be like, Ugh. he'd be super scared if he saw that. You know, if she took off her top, Chin will definitely not like happy. If she took off her chop, if he, if she took off her top, Chin will do this. Let me see if I can find the video. Uh, what is it again? Uh, let's see. If she took off her top, Chim would do this. Let's see if I can find it. Oh, where is it? 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 Bear with me a second. I'm sure I have it here somewhere. There we go. I found it. I found it. I found it. I found it. If she took off her top, this is what Chin would do. Bear with me a second. Uh oh, watch, watch! I'll show you. I'll show you. If she took off her top, Chin will do this. Do you wanna play? Come on, brother! Don't piss me off now. Oops. Brother, ugh. what's that? What's that, brother? <laughs> That's what Chin will do. <laughs> one more time. One more. One more. One more. One more time. <laughs> if she took off her, if she took her top off, right? If this young lady here, if this young lady pulled out. Those fucking heavies, right? If she pulled out those heavies, this would be Chin's response. Lives, Ugh. brother. Ugh. What's that? What's that, brother? He <laughs> made <laughs> 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 He made me do it. <laughs> Pants right now. Oh yeah, I get it. You get a nice broad shot? <laughs> That's so funny. Do you just like hate flamingos or something? <laughs> Big bro, what's that? <laughs> Chin will scream like, Big bro, help. Help, Big bro, help. <laughs> She got, she got out the heavies, big bro. She got out the heavies. Are you a flamingo this, hater? Huh? Are you a flamingo hater? No, I'm not wrong. What are you against flamingos? What? What are you against flamingos? What? What did flamingos ever do to you? I'm just saying your pants look. They're... Oh, they're negging each other in front of the hose. Yo, mandem, you know it. Mandem in the chat. Look what they're doing to each other. They're they're negging each other in front of the girl. They play, they're playfully bantering each other. Trying to, they're trying to like compete. Ah, oh, this is so cringe. No, they're fighting in front of the home. Listen, <laughs> that's so funny. Do you just like hate flamingos or something? Yeah, it's like a dirty Mac. Look, are you a flamingo hater? Huh? Are you a flamingo hater? No, I'm not wrong. What are you having against flamingos? What? What are you having flamingos? What? What did flamingos ever do to you? I'm just hey. saying, your pants are pajamas, man. <laughs> Where's a friend? Where's a friend? Where's a friend and where's a girl? Did they leave? Oh, someone's laughing. I hear, I hear a woman laughing in the background. She's not laughing at Chin. Oh, 
Oh, Chin went, Chin, Chin went home alone. <laughs> <laughs> Chin left by himself to go meet Big Bro. Chin was like, Ugh, that's disgusting. I'm going to hang out with my Big Bro. Chin was like, nah, man, that's disgusting, isn't it? Chin, Chin, Chin saw her getting ready. He was like, nah, bro, that's disgusting. He was not having that. This is Chin. He's like, nah, man, nah. Law. Law. Notice this culture? Relation. It's very poisonous. He's hiding. Law. Everyone loves. What is, what is Pain, it? brother. Pain. What do you mean? He's sooner. Eat on the floor. Eat with your fingers, grow a beard, live simple lives. Ugh. <laughs> Brother, ugh. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> What's that, brother? Big bro. What's that, big bro? What is that, big bro? <laughs> Until next time. All right, we're finally. <laughs> Look at Chin, he made a defeat. He's at home. look, he's alone. No bitches, no number. I think Gates. We have like 45 minutes to go before we board. And uh, I'm thinking about getting another sip. And then on the flight, we have a dinner and unlimited drinks, right? Bro, unlimited drinks. Jesus Christ, bro. Another sip. Is is Chin maybe a, a sly alcoholic? He drinks quite a bit, doesn't he? No? Well, we have like a... It's, it's way longer now. It's like a four-hour flight back. We'll make the best of it. Second trip a week. Second Austin trip a week and a half. Let two, so what? Second Austin trip a week and a half or two later. Fuck, you know, this guy's English isn't his first language, is it? Here we are on the plane. Where's Mark? Here's Case. This is our Airbnb. So, what's the. Oh, this is a very big Airbnb. There's what, five of us? I think so far. The Airbnbs in Austin are really nice. I'm not going to lie. Maybe I'm so used to traveling to shitty Airbnbs in mainland Europe, but the quality of your Airbnbs in the States is really quite good. I'm not going to lie. It's probably worth the travel just to see what the Airbnbs look like. Not bad. I, I bet your hotels are pretty nice too, because not bad, not bad. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bunk beds. I don't no. want to stay here. Nice. Well, Pick rooms. A bunch of bedrooms like really close to each other. I like how he's not describing the Airbnb. I wonder if he's not describing it because there's company downstairs. He's feeling shy. He's feeling embarrassed. People are downstairs listening. He's not saying anything. <laughs> food. Yummy food. You can have this. It's, mine. it's all mine. It's not. Oh, this is the breakfast one. Yeah! Oh, is that, are those tater tots? Or is that breakfast? Or is that home fries? What is that? 
Are those tater tots or are those, are those home fries? That looks fucking good. That's yours. Oh, wow. I don't know, weenies? Yeah, but it's with the bread? What? We're just add bread. Oh, home, okay, crusted home fries. That looks fucking tasty. French toast, home fries, That's gotta be yours. some sauce. That's definitely yours. Ooh, I guess they just good, add bread to everything. They didn't put eggs in. I need to, yeah, I need to get to Austin. I want to go to Austin just to visit the comedy mother shit, but I need to go to fucking Austin. Once I get my fucking money up, I think that's the next big trip I'm doing. New York and Austin. New York and fucking Austin. We're going to do that shit. You feel me? Breakfast comes with eggs. What kind of world is... Uh, Ooh, that looks good. No eggs. Did you actually touch it? Yeah. I had no idea. Yeah. Mm. Yummy. <laughs> Check out our pizzas. What's this pizza spot called? The pizza looks good, man. The pizza looks... Really? Joel from MIA says the food sucks. Really? What, you mean the food sucks in Austin? Or the food in general in America is not good? As an, as an English person, like... Yeah, just just do NY. Austin ain't that. Ain't shit. Really? Okay. Fair play. Fair play. Brooklyn Pie Company, dude. Uh, okay. What's it called? Brooklyn Pie. You think these guys are pizzas at ass? Let's see what it's looking like. Brooklyn Pie Company, Austin. Let's see what it, let's see what it look like. You guys think this is terrible? Let's pick anyone, doesn't matter. Let's pick uh, A. <clears throat> so do you do you guys have better pizza where you're from in the States than this? Do you guys think it's this is overrated? This is not good? Let me know in the stream chat. If you got wherever you're from in the States, do you think you have better pizza than this? I'm just scanning for the pictures now. What do you guys think? Do you have better pizza than that? That's some generic. Okay, Coiler generic. Okay, fair enough. I'm not a big pizza expert, so I don't know what to call it, but I think Coiler's saying it's generic. I trust you guys. I think you guys are foodies and you know what you're talking about. Cheese sliced there. But you think this is all um, generic, yeah? It's not, not too impressive. Um, Austin barbecue ain't shit. Well, this is called Brooklyn Pie and it's in Austin. Okay, cool. You know what I said? Good point. Brooklyn Pie and it's in Austin. It's like a, um, it's like a chicken shop that also serves pizza, right? A place that does fried chicken that does pizza. Usually, one or the other isn't great, you know? If they don't specialize in one thing, it's probably not going to be good, yeah. <laughs> That's a very good point. Brooklyn Pie in Austin. <laughs> I think that's the thing that um, they got, right? That fucking plate full of stuff with the with the sauce and stuff. Cool. Okay, fair enough. Fair play. You guys are right. Dude. I, I trust you, dudes. <laughs> Don't you find it interesting that Chip he's not socializing with them. He's just on his own recording himself eating. Don't you find that funny? He's with some dudes who actually have a personality. Who don't mind having a laugh. And he's just pointing the camera at himself eating. Alone. That's him. This bastard. Oh, they're, 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 they're trying to force Chin to have some fun, but he's refusing. Oof, that's a good screen grab. I need, I need, I need that. I need that as a screen grab. I need fucking that. I need that. I need that. That's a good screen grab. <laughs> Is this the world famous Chin Cam? Mm -hmm. Did I make it into the world famous Chin Cam? <laughs> Dude, both pieces are really good. We're setting up for the Fighter and the Kid live show. It's a little hectic right now, but um, I think we're going to get everything under control in a bit. But uh, yeah, let's show you around real quick. On the stage, one camera. 
It's a big place, isn't it, the Vulcan? It's a fucking big place, bro. Eleven, and they've only sold eleven tickets so far. Eleven out of three hundred and twelve. Damn, man. It's when it when you don't sell tickets, this place can you feel it. There's a lot of space around it. Why didn't they put the this is a fire in the kid coming at you live? That was such an easy win to just say that. Hey, it's a fire in the kid like as part of the intro music. Why cut that bit out? Such a weird thing to do. It's like three more. What do you got, brother? Fuck, don't even have a well. Can Sorry. Can Chin be the next one? Can Chin? Can Chin be the next one? He's here. Chin's here, dude. Hey. Chin, come on up. Chin's right there. Come on up, Chin. Get up here, chin, 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 chin. Dude, I gotta say this. This motherfucker. He included two of these bits in the video. One at the start, one in the end. Grab, grab, grab that wart mic, chin. Let me tell you something about this guy. Let me tell you something. That's that is our that's our rock. Chin, no matter what, through thick or thin, this motherfucker. This motherfucker has been there for us. Oh, that was an awkward high five and a hug, isn't it? One more, one more time. Yeah, you can't fire him because without him, you guys would be fucking done for. That's our, that's our rock. Look at the high Chin, five. No matter what, through thick. Look at Brendan getting upset that someone else is getting all the fucking praise and not him. Brendan didn't high five him. Didn't give him a congratulation. Didn't agree. Look at his weird high five between them. Or thin, this motherfucker. Look at his high five. High five, and then it went into a dap, and then went into a weird awkward hug. This motherfucker. Uh, they're so close has been so far than this <laughs> if, this is the guy who always keeps us together no matter what he goes guys guys fucking just stay positive he's just there's nobody tougher nobody tougher nobody better than that dude Thank let him talk tougher what's this tough after they've been positive you can't how do you how do you how do you be positive when you got raped when you entered Fuck. Sorry, I had to give him a I had to, I had to give him his intro. Who has a question for Chin? You have a question you for Chin? You won't get an answer, but ask. Go what ahead. What do you got? Uh, we love you. Thank you. Thank you for coming out. We appreciate it. We it was actually Chin's you. idea to come out to Austin. Yeah. yeah. I'm from Texas. You guys remember this, oh. right? I'm from Texas. Fucking Texas. You do it, okay? Well, it was a great time, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. And there it is. There's our Airbnb. Time to go home. So here we are at Phoebe's Diner. As you can see right there. It's one of the highest rated breakfast brunches or breakfast brunch areas here. Let's enjoy. <laughs> Chin going outside. And then recording coming inside while his friends are sitting inside is fucking hilarious. <laughs> he's so he's so he must be so annoying to hang out with. Honestly, hanging around a content creator must be so awful. Like maybe hanging out with me and I'm constantly fucking talking about podcast topics must be awful. But hanging out with somebody like this, that's record like you know, but you're sitting down and goes back outside and starts recording to go back inside. So cringe. It's one of the highest rated <laughs> breakfast brunches. <laughs> breakfast brunch areas here. Look at him. He comes it's back right. inside. Chin loved it. It's the first time he's been kissed in fucking years. It's the first time Chin's been kissed in fucking years. We're in Texas. Yeah, exactly. A beer for breakfast. Yeah. yeah like, look, let them live in it. Let them live. The food was great, but the service was even more amazing. Looks freaking incredible. That looks good, though. To be fair, 
Let's not lie. That looks fucking scrumptious. Um, what is that? Is that is that like a schnitzel? Is that a schnitzel or something, right? And then you got some asparagus there, some nice roasted potatoes. That looks fucking banging. That looks and some spring onions on top. Like I would demolish the fuck out of that. I would eat that up. Fried chicken. Was it chicken fried steak? B. Okay, cool. Chicken fried ginger ginger. Yeah, that's a chicken fried steak. That looks really good. Yeah. Yours looks awesome. And yours looks. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. <laughs> wow, what a weird way to eat with a fork. Why do you eat like that? Why do you go like that way around? Wow, why do you walk like that? Why do you what's why do you eat with a fork like that? Is it is it special needs? Why do you do that? Look at this. How do you eat and then have your your mouth that way? Great vlog. Never met him. Later that day and night. After the trip, I went home and started editing. Of course, you started editing. Of course, you started editing. Had to mix most of the different audio files. It was quite. Well, check out the editing here. That's what we said. I know. It's fucking hot and it's fucking tattoos. Mm, that's, 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 that was the extent of how I brushed well, it. Well, I know it's just hot. Nope. I, I refuse. I'm not listening to your songs. So that was Chin in Austin. He had a good time. He sucked up to his buddies. He called his big bro, big bro all the fucking time maybe because he doesn't let him say his name. I don't know. Um, the food looked good. The company looked pretty chill. He let he he um he brought out that that girl with the big tits. Let his friends fuck her, which is nice of him to do. And um yeah, he just kept doing what Chin does, isn't it? Chin tings, chin, fucking chings. The food looked good though. I like the food. I'm not gonna lie. The food looked fucking scrumptious. I would devour all those plates that were on display.